if I were to do any professional development here with uh, the teachers that I've come in contact with, the first thing I want to do is to give them a good experience in learning mathematics themselves. It seems to me that the teachers here have learned mathematics as a rule-based thing. Uh, they like to teach children rules, uh, how you do this, the procedure to do this. So if I were to do something with the teachers, I'll give them a very positive experience that employ their strengths. And the ability to visualize, to see connections, and to communicate, these are very basic human competencies. And it's, if you use strengths to help people learn, then it becomes something so easy. But on the other hand, if you make them memorize, that's not a human strength. Uh, to follow procedures, that's not for humanism, it's for robots and machines. Uh, to, to do things like this, then I think that will be using their weaknesses. Mm -hmm. And you know, when you use human weaknesses to learn anything, let alone mathematics, you won't achieve very much success. So if I had a chance to do something with teachers here, which I had actually in Scarsdale, uh, I would first embark on just a very nice experience of them solving difficult problems, but in a way that they all can manage, uh, where each and every one of them will go away thinking, wow, it's not so bad and it's quite exciting actually. And hopefully they will then, uh, in a way, change their mindset about what mathematics is. And I think that's probably the most important thing for me if I were to train teachers in this country, but anywhere actually.